what's up everyone welcome back to another episode of send it frankie wow after like what four weeks we're finally back uh so happy to be on the bike to be honest um i'm pretty sure a lot of people like you or like me um once want to ride but just so much issues with going out on the trails because there's people and then the trails are closed and blah 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 and uh i think people's lives are changing constantly everybody's trying to adapt so a couple of new changes in my life things have been going insanely fast things have been changing insanely fast so you know some things uh more or less things are changing so it is very highly possible very probable very likely that i'm gonna redirect all my focus into youtubing we're here in glendora and uh we're here seven in the, uh we're here while well, we were here five in the morning but i ran into a couple of issues <laughs> which i'll give you give details on give those my issues later on but anyways hope you guys enjoyed today's episode because more to come i have a lot of things to share with you guys in terms of uh how i'm going to cope how i'm gonna cope into the future okay it's kind of hard to ride and talk at the same time focus <laughs> but since so many things are changing um, and i hope they change for the good most likely you'll see another video tomorrow and so on and so on and so on and uh it's more like I'm trying to pledge myself to pedaling 365 days so that's one of the challenges i want to do um and to prove that i'm doing 365 days i'm going to try or at least try to try to do daily uploads which is insane i know but you know what we're in ins we live in insane times you know when we do crazy stuff Crazy things happen, we need to do crazy stuff. There you go. <laughs> All right. Hopefully. <sighs> Whew. It's been a while, man. Man, the cardio. You know, I'm riding an e bike. <laughs> just to show, just even if you stop for three weeks, the physical is just gone all right hopefully my type of social distancing uh, is great and i finally talked to ellen if i need to ride i need to ride five in the morning so that's the other pledge i'm gonna be waking up very early every day show you how we cope and how everybody copes and how we need to adapt we need to change because life life is about adapting life is a constant change and you need to stay positive if i can do it you guys can do it too you know maybe that's been overused but ah who knows we do this day by day I hardly come to Glendora when it's something like this. Whew. Wow. Look at that. I need to take a photo. We are in Southern California, by the way. <laughs> 
This looks place looks amazing. Seven in the morning. Oh wow, look at that. Oh, it's such a such a bummer that it has to be the spring that we can't ride. Look at this. This is beautiful. It's so green. Oh man. How can you not get emotional? All right, guys. Wow, look at this background. It's it's amazing. I need to be up here every day. I think I'm missing the best rides of my life. Not riding early. And uh, just a quick update for you guys. So basically, I am pledging from today. I'm going to do a 365 days on pedals. It doesn't matter if I'm pedaling at home. It doesn't matter if I'm pedaling on the trails. Every day, I need to get on the bike. So... Uh, my pledge to you guys, since I haven't made videos in, you know, three or four weeks, because I'm trying to come up with content because I can't ride. So the best solution I've come up with with my wife during this crisis is to try ride every day, early as possible. So I was here around 5, 5 in the morning. So we're, I'm waking up at 4, 4.30, getting here at 5, 5.30, ride for an hour, two hours, and go to work and my plan is to try to do this every day for 365 days well i mean i don't, I don't think i'm going to do 365 days in the beginning i'm going to try and get into that zone but i will try hard you know i will I, i'll do everything in my power i'll include fitness i will include the food i'm eating what i'm doing in the mornings and this morning i will have to say it's, it's so challenging um because there's you, you you have to get used to the whole thing of waking up at four and your brain start working at four when i woke up this morning I, my brain wasn't working it was like Ugh, what am i doing i'm just doing random shit. but i want to bring you guys along the journey because i think everybody wants to ride and you know social distancing riding it's like you gotta ride if you don't ride i'm gonna go crazy you know sitting home doing nothing is pretty insane but anyways you guys check out this view Holy shit. I'm just gonna leave this here. Honestly, this is what we ride mountain bikes for, to see something like this. To feel, to feel the fresh air, to feel alive, to feel good, to feel everything is at peace feel one with nature to get away from whatever is down under the ground uh, under those clouds you know I think that's what all the youtubers subscribe to all the MTB youtubers want to do it it's it's the way to live life it's the way to live all right guys never did this but this is a Glendora full pole. Ugh. Tire pressure guys, tire pressure. <laughs> totally forgot I need to release. Don't do what I'm doing. Yes. I'm just estimating I had like 30 PSI this morning. Super high. This is not the way to test for fire pressure. But I had it at 30 PSI, which is like super crazy. So back onto the ride. Alright guys. Gondora, full pull. Always remember. Check your shock settings. Oh, all right. Everything looks good. Full pull.
Okay. I need to do that again. <laughs> Wow, I landed way too left. <laughs> I went way left. I need to stay right. <laughs> okay, that's how you do it. <laughs> I went way over. Legs are sore after three weeks. I'm the Pimpio Popo at Glendora. This is crazy. Oh, I'm sitting down. Oh, oh. Woo. Attack position is pretty tough after three weeks. Oh, I gotta get back into things. Phew. Oh, this bike feels so good. Oh my god. Ah. Hopefully you guys will enjoy that. Woo! Woo! This whole pull is... Woo! Hikers. Slow down a little bit. Everything is blind. I feel like I'm turning around into some hikers. Not nearly as exciting as Tommy. <laughs> what I try. I try to think of myself as my hero, Tommy. <laughs> Every ride putting his life on the line. <laughs> Which is such admirable. It's like it's insane. You know, it's he's almost a stuntman in, in my mind. He's a stuntman. <laughs> the type of falls he does, that he takes. 
Woo! That's why I love watching his clips. That looks much steeper <laughs> from here. All right, we're almost done, guys. Man, this bike is so good. And that's the full pull, guys. Uh, whew, that was a lot of fun.